Hi, welcome to Palma Global Online Class. My name is Jennifer. Today's topic is division. Four digits divide by two digits with over quotient. Some teacher might teach you when you face this type of uh, questions, you should restart or redo the question. But we think it's not a good way because there is a special way, skill to solve the uh, division questions with over quotient. I'm going to show you how to do this type of uh, problem with uh, over quotient skill. Let me show you in the following uh, videos. Stay tuned with us. Thank you. Now we are going to learn how to do division. Four digits divided by two digits. Also with over quotient in it. Example is 1702 divided by 46. First, we need to place the dividend. Four digits. Four. Subtract three is one. We then know we should place in the dividend in the units row. Let's try this question. One seven zero two divided by four. 46. Here, 17 divided by 4. We know the quotient is 4. 4 times 4 is 16. The remainder is 10. Then 4 times 6, 24. Here, the remainder is not enough. We call this over quotient. The quotient is too big. We subtract quotient one time. Add it back to the remainder, which is 4. 1 plus 4 is 5. Next, we <coughs> use quotient 3 times 6 is 18. 50 subtract 18 is 32. Now the remainder is 322. Two. We try to find out the quotient for the next, the unit row. 36 divided by 4 is 8. We put on 8 in the units row. 8 times 4 is 36 subtract 30 uh, is 32 subtract 32. The remainder is 2. But we still need to do the next 8 times 6 is 48. Here the remainder is not enough. It's over quotient again. The quotient is too big. We need to reduce the quotient one time and add it back to remainder. One time four is four. Now the remainder is 46. We use the quotient seven times six is 42, subtract 42. And the remainder is zero. We know the answer is 37. Now you have learned the question, division question, four digits divided by two digits with over quotient problem. You now know the skill, how to use it. If you like, you can try this question at home.
1,488 divided by 24. This question has over quotient in it. Try it and make sure you know how to use over quotient skill. Thanks for listening. Pama Global Online Class is in an irregular basis in Chinese and English. You can visit our website, www.pamaglobal.org. If you want to learn from us for any special topic, please write email to us. Our mailbox is pamaglobal at gmail.com. We will try our best to show the topic in Abacus on our website. Thanks for your watching today. See you next time. Goodbye.